क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन से इज वेन अ सर्टन मेटालिक सर्फेस इज इल्यूमिनेटेड विद मोनोक्रोमेटिक लाइट ऑफ वेवलेंथ लैमडा द स्टॉपिंग पोटेंशियल इज थ्री वी नॉट वेन द सेम सर्फेस इज इल्यूमिनेटेड विद लाइट ऑफ वेवलेंथ टू लैमडा द स्टॉपिंग इज वी नॉट द थ्रेश होल्ड वेवलेंथ ऑफ द सर्फेस इज नाउ डी स्टूडेंट्स एज पर द फोटो इलेक्ट्रिक इक्वेशन वी कैन राइट दैट द इंसिडेंट एनर्जी would be equal to work function phi not plus e into v where v is the stopping potential phi not is the work function and e is the incident energy in the first case the incident energy is equal to hc by lambda this will be equal to phi not plus e into 3v not because 3v not is the stopping potential in the second case the incident energy is hc by 2 lambda this will be equal to phi not plus e into v not dear students let us multiply the second equation with 3 and subtract it from 1 we would get that hc by lambda minus 3 hc by 2 lambda is equal to phi not minus 3 phi not after rearranging the terms we can write that 2 phi not will be equal to hc by 2 lambda now dear students if the threshold wavelength is lambda not we can write down that phi not will be equal to hc by lambda not on substituting this in this expression we can write that 2 times hc by lambda not will be hc by 2 lambda which means that lambda not will be equal to 4 lambda and therefore dear students the correct answer for this particular question is option number 1 now let us proceed to the question number 12 question number 12 says that the ratio of potential energy to the total energy of an electron in a bohr orbit of the hydrogen atom is now dear students it is a fairly theoretical question and we must know that the potential energy in a bohr orbit is two times the net energy which means dear students that u by e would be equal to 2 which means that the ratio is 2 ratio 1 and therefore the correct answer for this question is option number 3 now let us proceed to the question number 13 question number 13 says hydrogen atoms are excited from ground state up to the state with principal quantum number 4 the number of possible spectral lines in absorption spectrum are now the students the absorption is possible only from n is equal to one state and the possible cases are that the absorption happens from n is equal to 1 to n is equal to 2 or n is equal to 1 till n is equal to 3 or n is equal to 1 till n is equal to 4 as we have to observe or analyze all the possible cases up to the state with principal quantum number 4 and hence there are three cases and for all these three cases the spectral lines would be different and hence the number of spectral lines in the hydrogen spectrum would be as per option number 2 that is 3 now dear students let us proceed to the question number 14 question number 14 is a theoretical question on x rays which says that intensity of x rays increases with increase in first option current in the filament second option potential difference between the cathode and the target third option mass number of the target material or fourth option which says frequency of x rays now dear students the intensity of the x rays depends on the number of emitted photons this in turn depends on the number of incident electrons now dear students the number of incident electrons can be increased by increasing the current in the filament 
and hence the correct answer for question number 14 is option number 1. Now dear students, let us proceed to the question number 15. Question number 15 says that the radius of the first orbit of hydrogen atom is 5.29 into 10 raise to power minus 11 meter. The radius of the second orbit of helium ion will be. Now dear students, the radius in a hydrogen like species can be written to be equal to 5.29 into 10 raise to power minus 11 into n square by z meters. Here we have to find out in the second orbit of the helium atom which means that n is equal to 2 and z will be equal to 2 as well. On substituting these values we get the value of r as 5.29 into 10 raise to power minus 11 into 2 square by 2 which will be equal to 5.29 into 10 raise to minus 11 into 2 meters. This student, this will be equal to 10.58 into 10 raise to power minus 11 meters and hence the correct answer for this question is option number 3. Now let us proceed to the question number 16. Mm -hmm.